Day 48, Proverbs chapter 31, verse 20, the Amplified Classic Translation. She opens her hand to the poor. Yes, she reaches out her filled hands to the needy, whether in body, mind, or spirit. Our second portion of scripture comes from 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verses 6 to 8, the New International Version. Remember this, whoever sows sparingly will also reap sparingly, and whoever sows generously will also reap generously. Each of you should give what you have decided in your heart to give, not reluctantly or under compulsion, for God loves a cheerful giver. And God is able to bless you abundantly, so that in all things, at all times, having all that you need, you will abound in every good work. The Proverbs 31 woman doesn't doubt, doubt the goodness of God because she enjoys it at every turn. She is generous to others because she knows this pleases God. At every single point in time, the Proverbs 31 woman has something in her hand to give others because she's a continual source of blessing. She is a conduit of God's blessing to those around her. Declare with me. I am a blessed woman. I am a blessed and generous woman. I am a blessed and generous woman and I bless others because I know that it pleases God. At every single point in time, I am a blessing to those around me. I honor God with my finances. I am always looking for avenues, for opportunities to bless those around me. I am not selfish. I do not fear lack. I am not afraid of lack because I know that God is always replenishing me at every single point in time. I give because it pleases God. I am a generous giver because it pleases God. I do not give and expect to return because I know that it is God who blesses me. I am generous because it pleases God. My motivation is pleasing God and therefore I am generous. I am the Proverbs 31 woman.